Good evening, I'm Ken Bastida. And I'm Veronica Dela Cruz. We begin tonight with Sonoma County taking steps in just the past few hours to clear the Joe Rodota Trail of a huge homeless encampment. The Board of Supervisors voting to buy two homes to provide shelter for dozens of people. But KPX 5's Andre Borba spoke with a San, Santa Rosa woman who says that one of these homes was hers. Andrea? Well, Ken, Veronica, the home behind me is one of two that the Sonoma County Board of Supervisors voted to purchase today. The woman I just spoke to a few hours ago says she got a notice in October that she had to go. Rebecca Innes lived in a back unit on this property on Sonoma Street in Santa Rosa with her daughter for 10 and a half years. She received a notice to move in October. The timing was seemed odd. I mean, uh, we were, myself and the other tenant on the property, we were given 60 days notice during the Kincaid fire. That in and of itself is really stressful. Today, the county voted to purchase this property and all units on it, along with another in Katati to house the homeless. I understand that there's tenants maybe in the other uh, property that the county did purchase, and I just personally don't understand why we would displace people to house people. That just, like I said, it seems like robbing from Peter to pay Paul. With a homeless crisis of nearly 3,000 people on the streets of Sonoma County and 250 just on the Joe Verdota Trail, Rebecca wants to make this point clear. I want homes over everyone's heads, so that's not my beef at all. She and her daughter moved into another place in the same school district around Thanksgiving. She told her story to the County Board of Supervisors today. My goal is that hopefully in the future when those kinds of things happen and we are purchasing and we're trying to make amends of obviously a really critical situation, that it's just all very clear, it's very straightforward, the public is informed, and I just don't want to see anybody moved out of their home again in this kind of a situation. Now, after the Board of Supervisors meeting today, one of those supervisors, Supervisor Zane, has agreed to sit down with Rebecca to discuss her case and see if there are any further steps that need to be taken. Live in Santa Rosa tonight, Andrea Borba, KPIX 5. The county also discussing proposed sites for a homeless shelter. In the last couple of hours, we learned the board has agreed to build a homeless shelter in Los Galicos Park. More on the proposed homeless solutions tonight at 11.